the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, who quit royal duties last year for a new life in America, have lashed out at the monarchy in a series of interviews. Royal commentator Richard Fitzwilliams described the attacks by Harry and Meghan as very, very damaging. Mr. Fitzwilliams told the Daily Star, the Sussexes' activities, when they've spoken out, have been very, very damaging. There's no doubt about it. He added that the Queen would have found Harry and Meghan's actions deplorable. Mr. Fitzwilliams said, she has realized how unhappy they were, but speaking out in the way they have is a totally different thing. The Queen will have found the way the Sussexes have handled things, I think, deplorable. Harry and Meghan made a set of damaging claims about the royals in their controversial Oprah Winfrey interview, which aired in March. They claimed royal aides declined to help Meghan when she felt suicidal and said a relative had made a racist comment about their son's skin color. And in a podcast interview last month, Harry compared royal life to a mixture between The Truman Show and being in a zoo. Speaking on the Armchair Expert podcast, the Duke also appeared to suggest that his father Prince Charles and the Queen and Prince Philip had failed as parents. Harry said he wanted to break the cycle of genetic pain and suffering for the sake of his own children. He added of Charles, H has treated me the way he was treated, so how can I change that for my own kids? Harry lashed out at his father once again in his Apple TV documentary series on mental health, The Me You Can't See, which he teamed up with Winfrey to make. He said, My father used to say to me when I was younger, he used to say to both William and First, well it was like that for me so it's going to be like that for you. That doesn't make sense. Just because you suffered doesn't mean that your kids have to suffer, in fact quite the opposite, if you suffered, do everything you can to make sure that whatever negative experiences you had, that you can make it right for your kids. Harry also accused the royals of total neglect and warned he would never be bullied into silence in the future. The Sussexes quit royal duties in March 2020 and are now living in California. Harry has returned to the UK once since Megshi for Prince Philip's funeral in April.